Moving on. Popular Nigerian comedian Clement Udupu Heme, also known as MC Descent, on Tuesday was allegedly molested by officials of Nigerian police at Doe State Command. Against this, some comedians, including Lawrence Osahekwe, popularly referred to as MC Kasono, staged a peaceful protest to the office of the Commissioner of Police to formally lay complaint. BTV News Best Orator completes the report. Speaking to the news crew after a closed-door meeting with the Edo State Commissioner of Police, Fonshua Degboye, Mr. Lawrence Osayeho, a.k.a. MC Casino, a company of other entertainers in Edo State, revealed that his colleague, Clement Udok Bogeme, also known as MC Dasaint or MC John Bosco, was needlessly assaulted by officials of Edo State Police, hence their meeting with the Edo State Police Chief. He noted that the State Commissioner of Police, with due diligence, publicly addressed all their concerns and allayed their fears on all the issues, adding that the police officers who were involved will be brought to book. Reaching here, the Commissioner of Police has assured us that the officers who were involved in that uh, very unprofessional conduct will be brought to book. I was, we also want to appreciate the Commissioner for his swift response. Indeed, uh, we can say confidently that we have a capacity Commissioner of Police in a do state. Immediately, Every complaint that we came here with was addressed, and the commissioner has also done a video to that effect. Whatever he told us, he has also asked us to record him. That is going to put it on the head, so we are safe with him, and uh, we appreciate him. The victim, Mr. Clement, aka MC Dasaint, better known as John Bosco, while relating his ordeal, decried the action of some officials of the police who have the habit of assaulting young men. He, however, commended the police chief's swift response, encouraging other officers of the law to desist from unjust assault of innocent individuals. Also speaking, the president and founder of Faculty of Peace Organization, Komi Kelly Osumbo, encouraged all members of the public to stand firm in their right in the face of injustice, advising all to be knowledgeable of the mundus operandi of officers of the law in the event of crisis. Three days ago, I was assaulted by some members of the Nigerian police force based in Benin City. I was assaulted. I was slapped. I was trained. I, I, I was beaten. I was manhandled. I was rough handled. And affected my mental health. <laughs> So, but we came with a complaint to the Commissioner of Police at those states. We were even supposed to come yesterday because he asked us to come immediately. But we had to arrange ourselves properly and now we are here. We had a, a closed door meeting with him and he assured us that the officers that actually assaulted me will be brought to book. What I want to tell those people and by extension Nigerians, youth, try and get a police act. Is uh, You can even Google it. Know the duties of a police officer. Understand, understand the ethics, understand their their work and their and what they are. So when they are moving outside their line, you can politely remind them that what their constitutional duties that will help you. And I want to, we shouldn't we shouldn't be timid. At the same time, we shouldn't be rude. At the same time, but you can you, you will be timid when you are not properly informed. On his part, Edo State Commissioner of Police Fonshu Adegboye, while addressing the issue, empathized with the victim of the assault and his entourage. He further encouraged members of the public on ways of defense against unjust acts of assault. I appreciate you for to have taken this medium to express your mind, your dissatisfaction about the activities of some unscrupulous police officers harassing uh, law abiding citizens in the state. It is not in our character. We have not been trained, we have not been instructed to do that. The Inspector General of Police, like I mentioned, is a complete gentleman, an enlightened police officer who believes in the uphold of the right of citizens. I want to apologize on his behalf for that, especially the one that was exhibited to one of our friends here. Whenever you see anybody, either a civilian or a police officer, not doing the right thing on the road. Kindly contact me personally and we are going to answer you immediately. MC John Bosco and his supporters are hoping that the command will indeed match words with action and bring the perpetrators to book. Best Orator reporting for BTV News.